The only Monday spring practice was held March 19th at a time when it wouldn't conflict with any of the players' class schedules. That's because it began at 6 a.m. I am a morning person because I'm always hyper. You know, I, I think I bring energy to everyone who's feeling a little dry in the morning. But um, that'll be the reason why I'm a morning person. Five foot eight, 185 pound Jeremy Gallon had a breakout season in 2011, but doesn't have much to say about himself. That's because it's all about the team. When I'm supposed to play, I do my job, and uh, Coach Heck always stressed that, you know, the toughest man in the air win, and, you know, just got to go get the ball. It's our job to do. So, you know, just go get the ball, block, do what we have to do for the team. Last fall, Gallon had the second most receptions and second most yards receiving for the Wolverines behind Junior Hemingway, who's on his way to the next level. So is it time for Gallon to take over Hemingway's role? Well, it's not about me. We all have to step up as receivers and uh, put in a lot of hard work. Uh, we lost a good receiver, Junior Hemingway, and uh, just have to, you know, work as hard, be as better, and continue to do what we've been doing, but better. With most of the starters returning on offense and a senior quarterback more comfortable with the new offensive system, you can imagine what Jeremy is looking forward to most in the near future. I'm looking forward to tomorrow. Just working hard and getting better every day. And uh, just trying to reach a goal. And that's to win a Big Ten Championship. Stay with MGoBlue.com for the most comprehensive coverage of Michigan football as spring ball moves ahead. And don't forget Michigan's public practice will be held at the Big House, April 14th.